They've set up on this grassy spot along Gilbert and right in the middle of a controversy. The fact is that homelessness in Cincinnati is, is real. They were moved off of 3rd Street and set up in front of Jack Casino. Now to this spot next to the Baldwin Apartments. Some here say it's a political runaround. I feel like uh, the mayor and, and, you know, the city is being heartless. They have no compassion for the lower class. And but there are some here who are surprisingly understanding of those who want to camp gone. I get it. You understand? I wouldn't walk out of my apartment with my kids and walk down like, bam, there it is. The first ban targeted downtown. The latest motion expands the no camp zone to all of Hamilton County. You can expect that to be challenged in court, just like the first motion was. The only solution right now, right now, is that the city can simply stop criminalizing people, stop chasing people, and work on permanent solutions of housing. Adding to the tension, police say some homeless advocates are telling the campers not to take social services available. Instead, fight the removal. Meanwhile, Reverend Damon Lynch III is considering allowing the homeless into a campground beside his Roselawn Church. That idea is also meeting with opposition from some community leaders there. For now, they're camping at the crossroads of a controversy. Now look, no one likes this situation, not the city, not the homeless, not the people that want to use these spaces. Uh, and the police feel like they're caught in the middle of this as well. They say they're using considerable resources when there's not really a solution on the radar. Reporting live, Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5.